What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to GazetteSports.com. It's Tyler. And JJ. And this bowl game video is brought to you by the fine folks at Naples Rib Company. And we're going to OCC. Are you down with OCC, JJ? Oh, you know me. Long Beach City College taking on Golden West, the team they lost to 42 to nothing in this season opener. But you know what? This Viking squad has grown as a team. They have uh, grown as a family and gotten a lot better winning their conference. And it's the uh, Central Championship Bowl game right here, looking to exact some revenge against a big physical Golden West team. <laughs> the Rustlers definitely want to get after Ryan Craighead, who's back with the Vikings for the first time in a while. Yeah, he's missed a couple weeks and he was back in action. Finding Willie Bobbitt, you'll see that plenty in this highlight. This is on the first drive of the game. Things are looking good and Craighead's gonna roll out, roll out, roll out. Keep that Craighead rolling out. And then he's gonna find Bobbitt just standing there in the end zone. So seven nothing Vikings, but right back at you were the rustlers. Quarterback Raymond Tizar is gonna be able to scramble here and uh, set things up. He was good moving in the pocket. As you can see another one, this time he's gonna go ahead and toss it out. And uh, the momentum snatched back by Golden West as they come down and Michael Pierre is gonna bust in, tying things at seven. Things looking tight here at the beginning. Indeed they were, and then the swing pass, the not the swing swinging it. gate, but swing it indeed. One really successful swing pass right here, and if it works the first time, why don't you do it again? Jared Cohen on the receiving end of this one, he's going to take it around the edge and into the end zone, 13-7 in favor of Golden West, and he is slightly turned up at this point. Yeah, he is. Then now, JJ, the interception show starts. Now right who you gets... want? <laughs> pick, pick, pick. Game over. Roosevelt Payne gets the pick for the Vikings right there. And then Craighead, unfortunately, picked off right here. Craighead, five interceptions on the evening. Not his best look with that line. And then the Rustlers, continuing to find big plays in the passing game. Jared Cohen going up and get this one. Oh, wow. He stick had stick to it. A amazing stick to itiveness. Nine grabs for 154 and two touchdowns for Cohen. And then Victor Maunanu gets in right there. 20 to 7 Golden West and then Moananu a long run again just weaving through the Vikings it seems that he doesn't care even though he has some long hair JJ Nanu Nanu <laughs> and then Cohen again this one is just as impressive laying out the determination what an impressive grab for Ocho this is amazing Cohen the king of the underrated catch <laughs> yes indeed and then this is how the Vikings offense should look Craighead finding Bobbitt uh, an easy throw over the middle, moving things downfield, then a slant to Sean Morris, setting things up, and then you end the drive, after all that possession passing, with a uh, run from Jeremy Jackson. He's gonna take it around the edge, duck, dive, dip, dive, dodge, and then come right at you. And right before the end of the half, Danny Anaya annihilates it from 49, JJ, and he's losing it that right now. That thing got out of here in a hurry. The laser show. <laughs> And after a wrestler's touchdown to start the second half, once again, slant to Trayvon Payne. Yeah, he found the window on that one. The window Payne, indeed. And then an easy pass to Bobbitt. We told you he was going to catch a bunch of them. This is how the Vikings want to look on offense. Then again, a Jeremy Jackson touchdown run. So, getting some excitement there, 37-21. That's only a two-score game. But on fourth down, you cannot just get sacked. You cannot mount a comeback when that's what things look like on offense. And this is a little bit of a game sealer. Oh, Mr. Watson, 58 yards to the tilt, 44-21. Still, the Vikings holding on to last hope. And who are they looking for? Willie Bobby, Willie Bobby. Indeed, that's his second touchdown grab. But then this play kind of shows you how it went. Can't handle the snap and then get crunched. Tough night for the Vikings. They fall 51-36. A much better showing against Golden West this time as Trayvon Payne uh, goes over 100 yards, closing out his great season. Bobbitt, 13 catches, 205 yards, and two touchdowns. He was MVP of this game. So a tough loss to end the year for the Vikings, but that four-game winning streak in conference to get them into this bowl game, something they can be happy about. For coverage of all Vikings athletics and, of course, football next year, stay in this spot, gazettesports.com.